Hey friends! So I bought a GigaPet and I'm gonna unbox it today! Yay! Um, so when I was little, I actually didn't have Tamagotchis. I had this very particular GigaPet. Um, it's the Floppy Frog. And I was chatting with somebody on Instagram the other day and she was talking about GigaPets and I just thought to myself, you know, I bet I could find a GigaPet. So I went on eBay and I found this one and it was actually pretty cheap. If you look online, there's usually, actually I'm just gonna start cutting into it. I think my plan is to cut this bottom part um, so that maybe I can save the packaging. I don't usually save the packaging, but this is like actually from 1997 and it's in its original packaging and I kind of feel bad about cutting it open because it's old. Look, you can see it says, um, focus there, 1997 right there. Um, and they did remake these a few years ago, but they don't look like this. Like this is like the original one with all of the original like artwork and everything on the body. So I feel bad cutting it open, but at the same time I bought it to play with it and it was pretty cheap. Anyways, as I was saying, so a lot of the ones are um, much more expensive on the internet, on the eBay. Um, like over a hundred dollars for some of the original ones. The newer ones that have AR in it, and I don't know if AR is like aug augmented reality or like what that stands for. Let me know down in the comments if you know what that is. Um, those ones are like twenty dollars, which is coming right out. <gasps> oh, oh my god! Look at it. Oh, oh, it's got the pulse. Like this is like original, guys. Okay. Oh, let's take a second and just look at it. In it's glory. It's got this garbage on it. Okay, good. Let's get rid of the garbage. So here we have brand new out of the packaging, never before exposed to sunlight, created in 1997, Floppy Frog Gigapet. I really like all of the little artwork that's on here. Here he has his little face. It says Gigapet's here. It says Floppy Frog. I don't know if these are like lily pads or what. These little shapes, they're funny. Um, he just looks really kind of bored, and I like that about him. Like almost like a Gudetama kind of vibe. And then there's really interesting little icons in here. I wonder how close we can get it to focus. So this looks like maybe it's like a... I don't know. I can't tell what that is. Like a fly, and then a moon, and a jumping frog, and then a stethoscope. A shower? Like a, like a bath? What's that? I do not know what this is. This is a bell and an exclamation point. Listen, we'll find out. And then if you look closely, you can see like a lily pad and like some pond water here. There's a lily pad with a flower and a lily pad that's just a pad that the frog could jump on. And then there's these two buttons, a left one and a right one, a mode and an enter. And the keychain is, oh, jeepers. Oh, the keychain's interesting because it's just this little clasp, so I kind of like that. That's easy for your, you know, child to play with or your grown adult like me to play with. Um, here's the pull tab. I'm scared to pull it. The batteries are included. I checked on it and they are included, so I'm really hoping that the batteries work because the batteries that it says that it takes, I don't have these. Let's see, where did I find? Oh, it says right here, um, use two times LR44 or G13A batteries. I don't have those. I looked in my drawer and I do not have those. Do you guys wanna look at the packaging? I guess we can look at that. So it says Tiger Electronics up here, Electronic Virtual Pet. Here's the image of Floppy Frog. He looks a lot more excited here. I like him better, like this little image of him right here where he looks just really bored. Wait, let me get a good, yeah, there he is. Look how bored he looks. I like more of a Gudetama vibe for my frogs. So he's looking really excited here, whatever. It says your virtual pet now with real frog sound effects. So I can't wait to hear the frog sound effects that will come out of this fun device. Hopefully when I pull the little tab, the batteries will still have juice in them. I don't know how long batteries are supposed to last. TBD. Um, and then here it says, name your pet. And it's got some little images of the frog looking cute. Tame your pet. Um, I do remember that like it starts as this tadpole and then it evolves into the frog. 
Um, and I thought that was really cute because it kind of changes. It changes a lot. Like I think the other Giga Pets, like it starts as like a puppy and it turns into a dog. And it's like, well, that's not really that big of an evolution, but like this is big, like a tadpole to a frog. And like that's how it is in nature, obviously, but I just think that's cool. And it says that play games with your pet. Yes, it can catch flies. Like as if I had asked, like, but tiger. Tiger Electronics, can it catch flies? And Tiger's like, yes, Tama Girl, obviously. It can catch flies. Great, thank you, thank you for answering my question. And then it says claim your pet, and I don't know what that means, but it looks like this um, terrifying man in this tacky hat has captured the frog, and the frog is upset, and now it's in this bag, and it's got these little lines coming off of it, like maybe it's smelly and dead. So, I don't know what that's about, you guys tell me. And then on the back, it's got a little keychain attachment, shows you clock function, that's fun, multiple stages of development. I wonder how many stages there are. Oh, we can name it, oh my god. Ah, should we just jump right into it? Oh, and then it does have all these other ones you can get. So dog, cat, T-Rex, alien, chimp, and a bug, and I think that's really fun. Um, this device is shaped differently from my device, and I don't know if that is like a previous iteration of the device or what, but that's uh, looking different from what I have. And it looks like there's maybe some instructions in there too. Should we try to get them out? Ooh, guys, look. There they are. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes, instructions. Oh my god. Wow. I feel like I remember this. Like, I feel like I remember taking this out as a child. Oh my god. Oh, this is what all the different icons are. Feeding, sleeping, playing, doctor is the stethoscope, obviously cleaning is a little shower. Oh, your score. It's a heart and it's a score, I guess. And then training must be like the discipline. Oh no, discipline is this, it's a sad frog. Your frog or tadpole can do all sorts of interesting things. Training your amphibian to perform tricks on command is very entertaining, is very entertaining. Okay, so we can teach them to do tricks. Fun, fun, fun. Oh, and then when they die, they look like this. Ooh, spoiler alert, their frog has wings. I feel like this would be a really cute tattoo. Would you guys get this as a tattoo? Comment down below if you would get this as a tattoo and then say where you would get it. Would you get it as like, a shoulder tattoo on your wrist maybe I don't know so okay I'm gonna set this stuff aside over here um, we didn't need these screwdrivers but I brought them anyways just in case and I'm gonna pull the tab guys I'm gonna pull the tab oh my god okay Ugh. one two three oh it's really in there ah, ah. Ooh, I did it ah oh my god I have to set the time Jesus, I'm gonna figure it out and I'll come back. One moment, please. Oh my God, guys. Okay, so I set the time and I named it, I named it Bear and it, oh, he's blowing us kisses and it immediately came out with this tadpole. So, oh, the nostalgia is so real right now. I'm so excited. It feels hefty in my hand, like it feels heavy. I feel like it's heavier than a Tamagotchi and it's definitely a different shape. The shape's really funny to me. Oh my God, I can't believe I have one. I love the see-through case too, like the plastic. I feel like that's so 90s and you can see all the, the little like motherboard in there, all the little like computer parts, that's cool. So, okay, it's got some clouds. The animation's really interesting on this. I feel like the, the animation is much more interesting than um, on a Tamagotchi. Okay, and then when you select, it doesn't light up, it kind of indicates it with these little arrows, that's fun. So let's try in score. Oh, it tells me his name is Bear. Okay. Score is 59 somehow. I don't know how I got any score at all. Okay, so he's, I'm assuming that's food. And I don't know what that is. Oh my God, this is very complicated. Oh my God, zero years, two ounces. Bear. Let's try to give him some food. Um, how do I get out of here? mode okay okay so this fly right here 
Where's the food? Oh, so we can give him seaweed or a bug. Well, let's give him a bug, I guess. Oh, he jumps out of the water and eats it. I remember this. Like, this is coming back to me. He's got this a similar happy symbol to the Tamagotchi, so that's definitely kind of a, a knockoff there. Oh, so I was telling you guys um, before, the pricing on this was really interesting because I... Oh, he's hiding under the water. This is so cute, I can't get over it. The pricing was really interesting because the majority of these, when you look on Amazon or eBay, they're over $100 and this one was $35. And I was very skeptical that it wasn't going to work because it's an original Gigapet in its original packaging from 1997. And I just felt like maybe whoever was selling it, like, knew that it was broken or had somehow resealed this and put a broken device in it. But I thought to myself, like, you know what, I'm just going to buy it and see if it works. Um, and that worked out. I, so he's got three foods now. I only gave him one fly. I think this went down though. Wasn't this at 80? Whatever that little man is there. Interesting. Let's try to play a game with him. So mode, I think, is the cancel button. Oh, look at this. This is better than Tamagotchi because you can go backwards and forwards on the menu. Ah, that's really convenient. I really like the animation while he's just swimming around. Okay, so I want to play a game with him. It was this hopping, hopping frog. So maybe I need both hands? I don't know. Okay, I'm under the water. Do I have to wait for a fly to come? Nothing happened. Hmm. So you wait here under the water. I feel like this is where it said, yes, he can catch flies or whatever. I don't know how to play this game. At least one bubbles again. Cute. What's this? This is just asleep. What happens if I do this? Oh, he goes to sleep. Okay, wake up. No, I don't want you to be asleep. No, I don't want you to be asleep. Wake up. Okay. What's this? The doctor? Oh, maybe that's what the dark clouds were. It was sickness. Oh, and then he wears a funny hat, and then the doctor says he's better. We can give him a shower. Okay, that's dirt. And now he's clean, and he's heavy. Okay. That's the score again. Let's see if our score changed. 60. See, this is going down. Maybe this is sadness or something. Like, the sadness is going down as you play with him. I don't know what the circle... I guess the happy face is happiness? Well, whatever. Anyways. Let's see, the bell was discipline, I think. Or no, the bell was training. Let's see what he does. Okay, reward. Sure. Okay. Oh, he can catch flies, guys. There he is, he caught a fly. Now he's happy. Mm. And then that one's discipline. I don't want to discipline him. So, okay. I guess that's it. My Gigapet. Hey, he wasn't making any noises. He was supposed to make realistic frog noises or whatever. But this is literally not making any noises at all. Hmm. Is it supposed to make noises at this stage? Can someone tell me down in the comments below if he should be making any noises as a tadpole? Is there a button I'm supposed to push for noise? That's the reset button. I don't know. All right. Anyways, so I have a Giga Pet now and I'm really excited about it and you're probably going to see a lot of pictures on Instagram with this little guy. Um, I think the color is really pretty. Somebody on Instagram told me that it looked like Barney colors. If this is you, shout out um, to you. Go ahead and comment down below if you know that you said that because I'm talking to you. And... Yeah, I guess that's it for the video. So go ahead and follow me on Instagram. It's at the Tama Girl on Instagram. You'll see pictures of my Giga Pet. And give this video a like right now. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I put out new videos. I try to put them out every week on Sundays. Hit the notification bell. Um, give a comment down below. Let me know that you liked this. Let me know if you have any other content that you'd like to see from me. And I guess that's it for now, guys. So I'll do my classic outro. Bye, guys. Bye.